Maya here. Welcome back to my channel. And for this week's video, as you guys can tell, my recording studio is now in full swing. The lights that I'm originally supposed to be using are not working yet, but I did get a backup light because the lighting obviously has to be good for my videos or else the whole video is just going to be like ruined. But anyways, for this week's video guys, now that school is back in session and you're getting homework and your tests and your quizzes and all that junk, amongst all of those things, a special occasion during this time of the year comes up. And do you know what that is? Your school's picture day. I'm gonna be totally honest with you guys, I've never liked picture day, probably because I've never really had a decent picture. And especially, I hate picture day in the fall because those are always the pictures that end up in the yearbook and I always look ugly in them and there's always something wrong with like my shirt or my hair or something. So I've never really had a good picture day experience nor a decent looking picture. But over the years, I've kind of noticed that there's always been different types of people on picture day. So for this week's video, I thought it'd be fun to show you guys the different types of people on picture day. But before we get to this week's video, if you guys haven't seen my face before or this channel, welcome, I'm Maya Hennessy and I do weekly Sunday videos here on YouTube. And if you guys like what you're seeing, then please hit that subscribe button. It's free and all it does is notify you whenever I do new videos just like this. Also, if you guys love what you're seeing, then please give this video a big thumbs up because it really helps. And hey, give this video a big thumbs up if you've never had a very decent looking picture on picture day because I'm with ya. But let's not dawdle on anymore and get straight into the video. The first person that you will see on school picture day is the person that tries way too hard. Their hair is done too much, their makeup is like slapped on their face and they're just trying way too hard to make this picture look good when in reality they actually look like a clown first in line please um sweetie can you look at the camera oh i'll be with you in one minute i just gotta make sure my makeup looks good you know what i mean you realize we don't have all day to do this right <sighs> fine Okay. Okay, can you please face the side for me? Oh, we're going to the left side, right? Because my right side's my good side. Although, I can work both sides if you want me to. Just please face the left. Glad it's my good side. <clears throat> Alright, smile. So, did that like look good? Because I really need to see it. You know what I mean? Just gotta make my picture look perfect. I'm sorry, but you're not allowed to see it. What do you mean I can't see it? I'm just not allowed to show you. <sighs> well, if you won't let me see it, can I at least try out some new poses? I have some really cute poses I've been dying to have in my yearbook picture. Like this one, for example. You realize there's other kids in line. We need to move along. <sighs> you know what? Me and my fabulousness are out of here. <sighs> Contrary to the person who tries too hard, the second type of person you will see on your school picture day is the person who literally doesn't care. This person is probably wearing sweats, their hair is a mess, and they overall do not care what they look like in this school picture. Next. Oh, um, sweetie, can you please put the phone away? Alrighty, face the side for me, and big smile! Are we done now? Yes, we are. Okay. Peace. Now, next to the person that tries too hard and the person who doesn't care, there's the person who literally forgot it was school picture day. This person shows up to school like it's an ordinary day, when in reality, it's actually school picture day and they are not at all ready to be in front of a camera. Next in line, please. Oh, sweetie, I really like the little casual outfit you've got going on. Oh, this? Well, thanks, but these are just my gym clothes. I didn't really know today was picture day. That's alright. Now face the side for me, and big smile! 
Now the fourth type of person that you will see on picture day is like the picture day goddess or god if you're a guy. Their makeup is on fleek, their hair is on fleek, they're wearing like the cutest outfit ever and their picture is literally goals. Although when they actually do get their picture back, they say they look really ugly, but we all know that they're looking flawless and it's seriously not fair. Like, why can't I be one of those people? Seriously. Next in line, please. Oh wow, you're really pretty. Aw, thank you. <laughs> no problem. Well, face the side for me. Oh, perfect. And smile big. The fifth type of person you will see on picture day is actually quite sad and it's not fun to be that person. And that person is the mess up. This person looks totally normal and totally ready for this picture. But when they actually sit down to take their picture, something always goes wrong. Either like they're sneezing or they're laughing or they blinked or something. And for some odd reason, the photographer doesn't notice and doesn't retake their picture for them. And then their yearbook picture is really quite embarrassing. Next. All right, sweetie, turn to the side for me and smile big. Ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> the sixth type of person that you will see on picture day is the awkward one. Just kind of like the mess up person, this person looks totally ready for this picture. But in reality, when they sit down and the photographer asks them to do something, they're quite awkward about it. Basically, they just can't seem to do what the photographer is asking them to do. Next in line, please. Hi there, I'm Debra. Nice to meet you. Um, Debra, can you please sit in that chair? Oh, in that chair? Yes. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, quick question before we start. Can I keep my glasses on? It's already bad enough my mom had made me put my hair down for this picture. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> okay, can you please turn to the side for me? Oh. oh, um, a little bit too much, Deborah. Bring it back. A little bit more. A little bit more. And stop, stop. Right there is perfect. Now, could you tilt your head to the right for me? Oh, oh my goodness, Deborah, too much. Bring it up. Little more. Little more. All right, right there is perfect. Now, how about you tilt your chin down a little bit? Oh, oh my goodness, Deborah, no, no, no. Up a little more. Keep going. Keep going. Okay, now stay exactly like that and give me a big smile. Oh my goodness, Deborah, no, no, no. Bring it down. A little bit more. Little bit more. Keep going. Okay, now stay just like that. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh. Oh, gee, the jocks are gonna think I'm so cool because I dabbed in my school photo. <laughs> the seventh type of person that you will see on picture day is kind of like the last two I mentioned. They look totally fine and normal for picture day, only when they actually take the picture, they don't smile. Either they're smiling and it's really not that noticeable, or they just have a blank face and there's like nothing going on here. Don't get me wrong, that's not like a bad thing or anything, it's just, what's the point of even being in a picture if you won't smile? There are many reasons most people do not smile in their pictures. Maybe they just really hate getting their pictures done, or maybe they have like a really weird smile and they don't want to show it on camera or something. I can't even tell you how many non-smilers I've seen in my yearbooks over the years because there are actually a lot of non-smilers out there. Maybe they're expressing the way they feel about picture day in their picture. Next! Alright sweetie, can you please turn to the side for me? And give me a big smile! Okay, or not. The eighth type of person you will see on picture day is the absent. Now I know what you're probably thinking. Maya, if you can't see the absent person, then how are you gonna see them on picture day? Basically what I mean is, the absent person on picture day just means that they're not there for picture day. And if they don't go to like the retake pictures, then their picture's not gonna be in the yearbook. And 
I don't know why they just don't say absent in my yearbook, but in my district, they always put the people who didn't take their pictures under camera shy. So if you don't take your picture, then you're under camera shy in the yearbook. Next. Hello? Is anyone coming? Who's next in line? Okay, well, this person is absent, and if they don't come to makeups, well, then they're just gonna be under camera shy. Now the last person you will see on picture day is me. I'm not saying I'm gonna show up to your school and be in your school picture day, but there are some types of people out there like myself, and most of you will probably relate, but we have a very annoying type of picture day. Basically, we sit down in the chair that we're taking our picture in and we smile and we think it's going so great and you look so good and you're finally gonna have a good picture, but then you get it back and you realize you look like a potato. This has literally been me all of my years of taking school pictures. I think I only had like one good school picture and it was in like first grade. Like. I always think that my school picture is finally gonna look good and then I get it back and I look like a potato. And most of y'all out there can probably relate with me. But it's okay guys, we can all be potatoes together, you know what I mean? But yeah, I'm basically gonna call this person the potato person. Next. Alrighty, turn to the side for me and smile. this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you guys enjoyed it, then please give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below what you thought. Also comment down below if you have seen any of these types of people on your school picture day. Also, if you guys want to see more behind the scenes of my everyday life, then please go check out my social media links. The links will be down in the description box below. And always remember guys, when you are in the spotlight, strut your stuff. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in next week's video. Bye!